everybody and today I'm doing some summer DIYs so let's get into this first I'm gonna do a balloon holder if your balloons just stay hanging and, they, and you don't have anything to hold them this DIY will help you Ta -da, I just dropped this all you need is a hair tie foil confetti which just pops so much more into it because like when you tip it upside down it stays and then you will need a decorated little cup so first, you're just going to decorate your cup with Sharpie and put in some confetti. And then you're just going to get your foil. It has to be see-through, but unless you want like the metal foil, but I don't think that will look really nice and you won't see your design then. And I think everyone has this to pack up their lunch boxes, their food with the lunch boxes. We had this today at the like Holy Communion party. So now you're just going to put it on top of the cup so it covers every single corner like so it has covered every single corner and just try and do it as neaty as you can so then you can so it looks nicer in your room than a messy one does but if you're not very neat like me and you can't help it just so what and look you sip it today and you can, it just looks so nice. Now you're gonna get your hair tie and just tie it the bottom so then the edges don't come undone and the foil just comes off. So I've got, I've put this on now and it looks cute already. But if you want to add some more de decorations, you can, but I don't want to. I just wanna like, I like it like this. We go I am not very I'm good at um I watch lots of DIY videos and no one's ever done this so that's why I'm doing it now if anyone's like oh I need to know just watch this my balloons are keep moving so that's why now you're gonna just tie a ribbon to your balloons and then tie them to the top of your cup. I'm just gonna use it so it doesn't like. So I'm gonna just take a half, more than half, and then tie it like that. So to tie it, you're just gonna just loop it. So you're just gonna take it over and loop, loop it like that, and then tie a nice knot in that. There we go. So that's good. There we go. And you tied it. Now you're going to make a nice little lovely bow in your extra ribbon so it just looks nice. So this is my finished cup. It looks really pretty and look if i show you from another angle but before i'm going to show you i'm going to do you a life hack first if the top keeps coming off like mine you can just use two bands yep but i found out that i didn't really need to use the other one but yeah that looks really nice in my room and it's just so pretty i like to leave it here so then you can see it so much better and yes I'm gonna do another way. So the next one is, for the next DIY, I'm going to be doing some summer pencils. So all you need is some plain pencils. You can get these from the toy stores, um, pound shop, the 99p shop, the 50p shop, uh, Morrison's, Tesco's, Asda, wherever. They all sell pencils. You're just gonna have to take the grips off if they come. I pulled the rubbers off because I like them because they're like shorter. Look so much pretty. And I've been rubbing them out loads and it's just really annoying. So, oh. Whoa. Okay, sorry. Sorry guys, I just had to do. Oh, sorry guys, I just had to do that. So, all you will need for this is some summer pencils. 
pens or Sharpies. I'm obviously going to use Sharpies. But it's so much better to use Sharpies on like plain things so it doesn't come off. And some bands. And you need the bands on how many pencils you've got. So now you're just going to draw whatever you want on your pencils. I'm just going to do some lines. So, yep. I just felt like doing lines all over the pencil. And now I'm going to just take the pink and do some dots. Well, you can't really see the pink. Oh, no. I'm going to use the green then. Greens. Yeah, you can see that. So I'm going to just do that at the end. There we go, it looks so nice. And now you're just going to take your favourite colour hairband. Which one I do? That one. Or well, that one. I think this one will look better on these bright colours. And then you're just going to tie it around wherever you want. I'm going to use it as a pencil grip so it will look nice then. Looks nice already though. You can put it wherever you want though. I'll put it here. It's optional if you want one though. But just gonna try and make it look nicer. Uh, look, it looks so nice now. Everyone will want it. Because you made it. Just gonna do that one. Now, this one. Oh, I might use this one. I'm just gonna do dots. Wait, no, I'm just going to make this a plain one with a hair tie. This is just going to be a plain one though. No one will have the same pencil as you at school because you made it and it's amazing. Even if it didn't turn out good, it was, even if it didn't turn out good, it's still yours. I might just do some dots and every other side every two sides so I'm going to do a side and then I'm going to miss out one well that's it that's all you have to do and then, and then I'm just going to do it one last time let me put one last time there we go so these are my two pencils and let's get on to the next one a decorate your own binder. I've already wrote my name on the binder, so all you need for this DIY is some paper pe and pens and some tape. But I'm not going to tape on today, I'm going to tape on at the end and I'm going to show you. So I'm going to go and get some paper. I just got the scissors, but ask your parents ask your parents' permission if you're allowed to use these scissors. We lost the kids' scissors, so we have to use this. I've got the paper. So now I'm just going to be just doing some, I'm just going to cut out a little shape, so finding how big my folder is, and I'm just going to cut it to size. And after this I'm rushing off to the theatre to do my dancing. I might do a video there, I don't know. It's, just, it's a bit long. I'm just going to cut it up to the size I like it to. I'm going to cut the corners off to just add some more detail. And it helps because my corners are like, look, that's perfect. Perfect, but I might want it that way. Yeah, that's perfect. Like, that looks good. Now I'm just going to draw my design and I'm just going to draw a picture of me and my friends. So I'll show you after. These are my friends. So I've got Ava over here. No, Ava over there. Sorry, Olivia. Ava over there. Then this little one is Imogen. This one, the tall one with the glasses, is me. The even taller one, the tallest, is Orla. Sorry, Orla. Oh, I'm just sorry, I messed up your hair a bit, you, sorry, it looks like you've got a circle in some boy's hair, but it's a bun, sorry, Anna. Lexi, Lexi looks good, she's the one with the curly hair, and that's Olivia, she kind of looks like me, just without the eyeglasses, but, yeah, I'm just going to stick it on in a minute, not now though, because I don't have any tape, 
bag. I'm just gonna put it there. That looks sick. Okay. And then next, I'm going to tr just take a little strip, and just now I'm just gonna cut a square out of that. And you're just gonna put. Then you're just gonna put a little message on. So and then it's just it's gonna be tiny and it's so cool. There you go. I don't think anyone could read that, but it's just a little message. My writing's really bad. And you're just gonna put that like there, and you can just stick that in the corner like that. And that will just look sick. Yeah, you should try that. Now, what was that? Now, for the next DIY, I'm going to do, this DIY is the easiest as well, but just a cup. And I've put some white stuff in it. And I've mixed it in. It just looks so nice. Like clear white water. It smells so good. Oh, it didn't taste too good though. So can it looks like like pure white look if I turn this around you can't see it it's just so white uh yep yeah. and then you can just decorate it with whatever you want to pop a bit more smell I'm just gonna put this on an Elsa perfume in I like frozen like doesn't matter if I don't like I'm not a big fan of frozen but this smells so good so don't judge me I like frozen a bit. My favourite is frozen fever though. This is a frozen fever, so I like this. And then I'm just gonna mix it. No, do not play with this guys. So I hope you enjoyed the video with this DIY. This DIY. This DIY. And my favourite DIY, this one. So, bye!